Hello, I'm Midas Racer. I'm going to talk to you about an iconic sports car. It's a composite monocoque, it's a two-seater and it's a roadster. No, I'm not talking about the Midas Gold convertible, I'm talking about this car. It's the Bagani Zonda F Roadster Club Sport Edition. I love this car and I really want to have a model of it in one on 18th scale. As you can see here in my cabinet, it's all one on 18th scale and I really want to have a Zonda in between. So what did I do? I bought this car, it's a Mondo Motors Coupe. It's an extremely poor model, but it doesn't really matter since I'm going to strip it down and rebuild it completely with uh, lots of detail. But then I came across an auction for a kit of the same car. Here are the parts. So I decided, well, maybe it would be nice as a winter project to build two Zondas, one coupe and one convertible. So I have decided to build, to rebuild this car in pearl white. Uh, wheels will be silver or chrome. Interior red or blue. I haven't made up my mind yet. Uh, several pictures on the internet so I'm going to use them as a guide. The Roadster of course will be the naked carbon car. It will be exactly uh, like this car. Carbon and yellow interior and the wheels will be dark metal, gray metal. It suits the car perfectly. It will require some special detailing which is not present on the coupe. Here's a picture of the convertible on the road surf from the top. As you can see this engine cover is completely different uh, from the coupe. Also it will require a rollover bars and there are some struts to keep it upright. And there's lots of small detailing like there is a metal plate in between the, the seats that has the name of the buyer, the purchaser uh, on it. So we have to make it as well. It will be a nice winter project with uh, lots of detailing. Already I bought some mesh. Where is it? For example, all holes will be opened and we'll get some very nice mesh. It's absol absolutely to scale. It even has the octagon style, so it's not a, a square mesh. It's a it has the correct shape and I'm awaiting arrival of paint and I still have to buy some carbon decal sheets because uh, this car will be covered completely in uh, carbon decal. It will be uh, a large job, very difficult but I hope I'll succeed. If you're interested uh, sign up to this uh, channel and I'll keep you updated on my progress. Thanks for watching.